no, it's fine. It's fine. Completely fine. Totally fine. Yeah, we're good. Totally good. We are fine. 100% fine. Yep. Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure we're fine. We're good. Hi everybody, welcome back to Garm Sports. My name is Ronnie. Um, my friend Alex is not here today. We're going to just talk about a little, little baseball, a little crack of the sport of the bat. You know, my favorite team, Boston Red Sox. Yeah, I'm not in my usual studio. I'm borrowing this um, this little setup from my good friend, Jack. Jack, I love you. You're beautiful. Thank you for the lighting. Borrowing it. Didn't ask. Sorry. Miserable. Well, we're going to talk about my team. As you can see, it's a blank wall behind me. Cause you know what? They've done nothing for me. They've done nothing to make me happy. But Ronnie, they picked up Perez. They give him another year. Yay! Another uh, four or five in the rotation. Who else do we have? Oh, we have a Voldy. Four or five. Okay, those two top spots are taken. Who else? Sale. Oh, he's coming back? Yeah, but they're taking him slowly. Oh. Oh, but he has to have backup, right? He's, there's someone behind him. Who's, who's, our, who's our number two? Eduardo Rodriguez. Uh. What? Mr. Throw the Glove Mad Guy? Look, look, nothing against the guy. I love him. Been a good team since we get traded him from the from the Orioles. Great. Awesome. He's a solid three. On a good on a good season. Solid three. I'm being very generous. Nothing against the guy. He suffered through um, the COVID and um, made it through. And uh, now I think I don't know if he's still dealing with it, but he dealt with health problem complications because of the virus. He's not back. But the fuck? What the fuck? Three of our starting pitchers have been injured for the past five years. Almost every single year. What the fuck? Uh, that's just tequila. Tequila, no ice, just tequila. I need something. It's, it's a, uh, let's see what time it is. It's a, uh, and I'm making this video out of spite. What have the Yankees done? Oh, what have the Yankees done? What have these sons of bitches done? They've made themselves the scariest team in the AL, by far. And it, it, there's rumors that they're gonna get even scarier by picking up a young pitcher who can throw a 97 mile per hour sinker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's even worse. That's scary. Excuse me. I need to. That's a zoop machine. I'm getting a little high, getting a little drunk, cause I need something to. Mm, calm the nerves. Calm the nerves, my friends. Um, Yankees have done a lot. Um, they pick up Voight. They're getting rid of Gabby Sanchez, someone who's been horrible at their backstop. Had that one good rookie year, fan, fan service and everything like that. Um, no, but he hasn't been worth worth it. And he's not worth um, possibly a $15 million contract that he's going to get. He, I mean, um, he goes back and forth. Years good, years bad, years good, years bad. But... They're the Yankees and um, they're put privilege guys who say, We need years of goodness every year. But so am I. I'm a Red Sox fan and I need goodness of every year. But they never provide that. Yankees, granted, are in the playoffs every, almost every other year or some shit like that. Red Sox, I don't know if they're going to make the playoffs every year. Honestly, the team of uh, Napoli of John, and Johnny Gomes, I didn't know if the Red Sox, I wanted them. They looked scruffy. They looked like, but I didn't really think they'd make the playoffs. Even with everything, I wasn't sure the bats were there. Big Poppy was able to do it. But you know, you know, you know. There's always questions. Maybe that's the thing about Red Sox fan. There's always questions. But you know what? When, they, when their balls are on the ground, they come and make it. They do it. They're the Boston Red Sox. Fuck you. Give me a goddamn heart attack. Oh, we're not doing anything this year. Nothing. Nothing. Toronto Blue Jays are better. Tampa Bay have, has lost a good amount of their core, and I think they're still scary. I think they are gonna they're gonna wipe the floor with the Red Sox. Like, how is that? How do you give up Sale, your one of your number ones? Um, Charlie Morton goes away for free agency, but you, you're still uh, a bit a bit higher than the Red Sox, who have lost no one from last year. 
They still have their core hitting. Uh, hopefully, J.D. Martinez comes back. Who knows? But we need a hitter. I don't care if you pick up Nelson Cruz. Right now, Nelson Cruz would be great. I'm very against a Nelson Cruz. Nelson Cruz scares me with the age and... um. With a little bit of the steroids. Sometimes the steroids cause a person to get injured very a lot easier. I don't know. I'm not a scientist. Um, but still, the fuck. Um, there, there's a lot more I want to talk about. Maybe I'll do another video. But this is a small rant going through. But. Thank you for joining me for my quick rant. Um, I've said nothing of importance in this video, but please like and subscribe. Um, this video is brought to you by um, uh, Frank's Bowls. Frank's Bowls, great bowls. To who? Are you tired of your kids' ceramic bowls? Throw all those shits in the garbage. You know why? We got to sell some Frank Bowls. As you can see, this is beautifully made, extremely smooth carbon. Very sealed. I see no holes and everything like that. Trust me. I'm an expert. He goes a little rustic with his um, features, too As you can see this could be like a little key bowl or something like that. So beautiful These are actual pieces of wood. He does this hand carves it very much himself hard-working man great man And as you can see this very very nice bowl right here. He also does um, Charcuterie boards and bottle openers. So please don't forget don't be shy to look up his store see what you want um, remember Ceramic bowls from your children are crap. Thank you, and please like and subscribe. Please.